Yes, it's me, Mark Vendor here again today. So I came across a video that has been circulating and people send it to me with a lady who is apparently a taxi driver down at the port complaining about the small man not getting any pick and 20 buses from one company allegedly leaving the port full and that the small fellas didn't get nothing at all. We also understand that talks are supposed to be taking place between the authorities locally and the cruise liners to try to make sure there's a little bit more equality in the whole operation. Now, I'm only a market vendor, but I would have to wonder, well, why these talks did not take place before we start back? Because we know we had a whole year, nearly two years of the cruise liners not coming to Barbados. So if, in fact, they're now coming back, we should really perhaps have cleared up some of these things ahead of the game and not at this stage of the game. Be that as it may, I just want to say it. We've been talking about sharing up the pie. We've been talking about not letting one person or one group of people have everything in Barbados. At the end of the day, we now got to act on these things. Because in the Bridgetown Port, when last I checked, get built off the sweat and the backs of ordinary Barbadians. Back in the late 1950s and up to 1961, I believe, is when it would have opened up. Hmm? And we had a lot of work, hundreds of workers. Costain was the big company back then. Hmm? So if we, the taxpayers, everybody in Barbados, help to build and pay for the Bridgetown port, it is only but fair that everybody should get a little bit. The port don't belong to no one body. Huh? All of we got a share in it. All of we is shareholders because we are taxpayers. And it is the taxes of Barbados that went to build the Bridgetown port. So if the taxes of Barbados from regular everyday Bajans help to build the port, it is only but fair that they should get a piece of the action too. The same protocols can be applied for the big bus as well as for the small bus, as well as for the taxi. Eh? And if a bus full of people in condition can travel, surely a taxi with four or five people can also travel if they observe the same protocols. And as for these cruise liners, if what I am hearing is really true, that they are saying that you can only go out when he wants, that they approve, otherwise don't come back when the ship. I have to remind them. Hmm? Y'all were parked off of Barbados for a year or more. Hmm? We allowed y'all to be here when nobody else didn't want y'all to come in into the waters because they didn't want the body with COVID. Uh, and we, Barbados, opened our arms, our shores, and welcomed y'all. And we kept your boats here. And many of our reefs were destroyed along the West Coast. And even that, the government of Barbados and the people of Barbados have apparently forgiven you for and you're not required to pay to fix it. Could dear, could dear, could dear. You mean to say that's how you're going to repay little Barbados? For standing by your side, huh? That a song called Stand By Your Man. <laughs> I think I should change that to Stand By Your Country, huh? Except that their country may not be our country, huh? Yes! If little Barbados stood by you during your hour of need, and we stood valiantly with you, when everybody else was abandoning y'all, eh? and now that's how you're going to repay the little country and the small people in that country who supported you, could dear, could dear, could dear, a little, a little conscience, a little ethics, eh? a little integrity would go a long way. I'm only a market vendor, eh? but I don't mix words when it comes to these matters. The cake got to be cut up. Nobody want, nobody can't come to a party and eat all the cake. You understand? Everybody got to get me city the cake and not just the crumbs of the, the cake. We all got to get a little taste of it. So spread it round and make sure that everybody get a little slice. You might not get as big a slice as you had before, but you're still getting something. I'm only a market vendor. I gone for now. You have a blessed and a wonderful day. You hear? <laughs>